Welcome back, my lovely students. Happy to see you. Happy to hear that you hear me from the other side. Okay, so right about now, I'm just gonna go to the HTML folder. Okay, believing you have found and downloaded this resource. If you don't, if you can't find that, just contact me. I'm always available in the comment section 247. Okay, so I'm gonna copy this assets folder. It's really what I like doing. Copy the assets folder and I'm going to go to PHP Storm, okay, and I'll paste this in public, okay, and I'll take a couple of seconds to synchronize. Great, and then okay, I think this is still loading. Let's see. Okay, so this is loaded completely, and then I would go to the what's it called the routes and go to web, and right here you see we have just the get route, which is the um, the welcome route. Okay, so what I'm gonna do right now is to leave it that way. Okay, go to the resource folder and go to views. Okay, so I'm gonna make a folder real quick and a file in it. So I'm gonna make the first folder called logged in. Okay, logged in. Okay, just sorry, that's supposed to be a folder, not a file. Let's call this logged in. Okay. And then I am going to create another folder called maybe home. Okay. And then I'm going to create a folder called a layout. Great. Now, what I'm going to do right now is to rename this welcome to index. I just like doing that. Okay. It changes nothing in particular but i love doing that okay just so changes to index as well great and now what i'm going to do right now is to just make sure everything is in place so i'll go back to reload my application and we can see clearly that everything is still in place now the next thing I want to do is to go to the HTML, okay, and in this index right here, we have, I'm just going to open with a lightweight code editor, and I think um, brackets would do the job for us. Okay, so index right here, I'm just going to copy this real quick. Now, in the layout right here, I'm going to call this create a new file in the layout called main blade.php okay so we have this okay main blade.php I'm gonna paste that in the layout okay so that's good now apart from that I am going to take off this container right here okay and I'm gonna say at yield okay and say content okay so we have that and for scripts right here add yield script okay and right here add yield and i'm going to say styles just style right great and in the index right here i'm going to take all of these guys out and i'm going to say add extends okay and it's gonna extend the layout dot the main okay and then I'm gonna start a new section and I'm going to see the section is the content and then I'm going to stop this section okay great and paste that right there so now if I view this in the browser 
you see we have this animation layout up and running great but for some reason I just like to wrap all of this in the assets function okay the assets Laravel built-in function now there's some the it's a reason I'm doing this okay because with time when you start deploying your application live okay it starts um, loading its resource that's this asset folders and files as a relative path and what that means is that when you try to access maybe a link other than this um, um, home right here or root directory index right here the asset file might not load up correctly okay you might not understand this right now I don't know how easy enough to put this but this is just good practice okay just do it so go wrap all of this just like so great so now for the index we would want to have the login okay we don't want to have the what's the call so I'm just going to collapse this gutter right here copy every item in it and for the index I'm gonna replace all these guys with this great so let's just see this in a browser real quick and bam guys we have this up and running now what this literally means is that the home page is going to be our index page the, sorry the login page is going to be our index page okay and that's good that's good so we need to create another route for our registration page okay so let's just do that real quick we go to app and HTTP controllers we already have a folder called alt okay but I just like to create mine okay so I'm just gonna click the control okay I think I can actually get the terminal from here so in the terminal right here I'm gonna say PHP artisan make controller And I'm gonna create auto controller, okay? Great. And then I think it will be nice for us to just create our routes immediately. So go to web and we're gonna say route. get okay and we're going to say slash register okay and it's going to go to the auth controller at register okay great and we're going to give this a name of register great so hopefully we get this correctly i'm just going to Copy this, go to our auth controller, create a public function, public function, register, and return. I'm just gonna return this. Okay, so let's just have that. So I'm gonna go to this site slash register. And if we don't have an error, we are golden, guys. We don't have an error. Now, for this i'm going to call this the home layout okay because when he's just trying to register the user is not logged in so i'm going to put this in the folder home and then we're going to call this register.blade okay.php great so we've got that up and running and i'm going to go back to my html and i'm going to copy this right here okay great copy that to that particular folder 
and we reload so we just have to in the auto controller we have to return view okay and this time around we say home dot register okay so if you're a newbie this is blade tap plating engine this is going to home and it's going to register okay in the views folder when you return the view folder it's going to home and register great so let's just reload this real quick and bam we've got this up and running but just one thing guys we still need to extend this layout just like we did for the login so we extend and right here you could say stop or end section whichever one you find convenient but i like stop so reload this and we are up and running so real quick guys i am just going to do something real quick okay for the for the log for the um the logged in which is the index right here okay this part where you say you don't have an account i'm just going to say route okay and i'm going to say register great so that means when we go to the home right here we click and you see we can go to the register so for the login i believe we should just set that to okay let's just say that to route home okay and let's see how that turns out oops we don't have a route name home it's supposed to be okay but we can actually name it home right here okay so let's just see that great so when i click on the login right here we'll go back home so guys that's pretty much it we have a ui set up completely for us and on the next video we are going to do some amazing stuff see you in the next video Bye bye